this is Mohamed Shakil here and uh, here I'm going to explain you about rigid joint which is coming under the DMU kinematics design workbench in KTW5 so here we have a nut and bolt mechanism uh, right in front of us so I'm going to show you what is the use of rigid joint so uh, so basically rigid joint is used to uh, you know make two parts or fix two parts rigid, rigidly so say you have uh, a part two parts here which is already being connected and which is already being simulated here so now I'm going to insert another part under the product and uh, let me create a part here so my part is uh, right over here and it's a uh, very thin part say very thin maybe around two so it's somewhere over here and now I'm going to go to insert double click on the product so that you come back to the DMA kinematics design workbench and you don't have to insert new mechanism because the mechanism is already there here and uh, you don't even have to fix anything just go to new joint and uh, click on the rigid button and show the software which are the two parts which you want to make the rigid joint to and click OK and you have the window called as a mechanism can be simulated so uh, you should make sure that you already have a mechanism you can make a mechanism by using any of the tutorials which I have uh, shown in my previous you know which which you can find in my channel once you do any of the mechanism use a rigid joint and see what is the uh, difference or what is the simulation it makes with it now uh, you can click on the speeds acceleration and uh, move it somewhere over here you can uh, see the simulation now so what has happened right here is uh, very simple actually this uh, particular nut here it was rigidly joined with this uh, new part which I've created the part 4 so this is how you can work with the rigid joint uh, this rigid joint comes very handy sometimes when you work with the kinematics workbench so I hope you enjoyed my video. Any doubts, any clarifications, you can comment just below my video and I'll be getting back to you as soon as possible. If you find like any tutorials you need, you can comment below my video and ask me for tutorials and I'll be uploading any doubts the same drill. So I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching.